Joining us now from the detention center in Tokyo is Bloomberg's Kurumi Mori. Kurumi, what was the scene like when Goen finally walked out? Yeah, Carlos Ghosn is finally out on bail after 108 days of being held at the Tokyo Detention House behind me. And when he came out, we've been waiting all day, all morning for this, this event. And when he came out, the cameras almost missed it because he came out with a group of police personnel wearing similar color dark outfit in a orange vest, a face mask, a light blue baseball cap and, and glasses. So somewhat of a disguise. And he walked into the van and it drove off. Behind that van was another black car and it carried uh, some of the futon mattresses from what, look, what it looked like along with some black bags which may be his belongings and presumably now he is with his family at the comfort of a, of a residence somewhere in Japan. And Kurumi, let's talk about what comes next for him because he's been released on bail uh, but, but trial still lies ahead. Right, that's right. The trial is likely months away, and because of that, his, his bail has many strict conditions, and that includes uh, cameras to be installed at the exit and entrance of his residence. He also can have no internet access and limited access to a cell phone. He also can have no contact with any parties associated, associated with this case, and he cannot leave Japan.